Figure skating for me, it's my life. I feel like I'm at home. I'm in Nasavska. I'm with my daughter and with my mother. Left Ukraine because of war. I live my happy life and I have my lovely job as a figure skating coach in Ukraine, in Kharkiv. I live with my husband and my daughter and my son, but my son Denis is living here for one year already. I'm really worried about my husband in Ukraine. When I came to Canada, we bought new uh, skates because we don't uh, imagine our life without it. I'm Anna. I'm 17 years old. I'm a student of Karazin University in Kharkiv. But now this building is absolutely destroyed. And um, when I skate, uh, honestly, I'm feeling like it's a freedom for me. Yeah. It's a very unexpected situation for me. And uh, my relatives and friends and neighbors, all of them help us, all of them support us. How incredibly lucky to have them here. They are alive, they're well. I'm taking every day as a gift with them. My name is Anna Plugatier, and uh, we have been hosting my cousin Ina, her daughter, for about three weeks. when the war started. So we were thinking we have to get them over. There was no hesitation. That was not something that we would ever hesitate. Family has always been very important to us. I feel like it's my responsibility to walk them through this. I don't know what people who are coming without any support will do. They will have to rely on, you know, the kindness of of Canadians and, you know, other Ukrainians who are here to help. There was a lot of you know, driving around to different places, trying to navigate what we need. I knew right away that uh, we needed to find a place for them to leave. People need to feel normal, to feel back in control of their lives again. So recently we helped Ina and her family move into the apartment. The move itself was incredible show of how community comes together. Oh, you're so welcome. Thank you. We're just so happy to be able to help. Thank you. Thank you. We are happy to help the community in any way. We are so moved by their strength and optimism. They bring us uh, all furniture, all kitchen staff uh, send us kindness and love. <laughs> I don't know what to say. It's, it's so pretty and amazing. I, I have no words. They did not plan to move anywhere out of Ukraine. They want to go back. So I hope they get that wish. I really hope war will end soon. I think I will go to university or college. For my life, I skate. Now I continue and try to skate here. It's my dream to work as a figure skating coach here in Ottawa. And we hope our life will be good. <laughs> I hope so.